Salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Old World Blues. I'm Mr. Mokla, of course, and look at the beautiful Sooner State. A little larger than last time, but as you can see, we have the Maxon chapter up here, as well as the Lionesses cohort back. So, I decided, even though I spent a lot of time actually off-screen, like, coring stuff, and then just tr tr trying to put down resistance, we actually have a little bit more manpower now, too. Um, yeah, I just tried to, like, put down suppression, but then, uh, like, why am I doing this? What about, what if... Instead of putting down people, we just liberated Max and Chapter and Lance's cohort, so that's how we got the little extra manpower back. And yeah, I've actually cored this piece of Oklahoma. Now, it was recommended that some of you guys said that which we should puppet or at least balkanize parts of Colorado and Lance's cohort, but I'm like, eh, I'd rather have it in one big old chapter anyways. I did core all this territory for them just because, technically, through the Max and Chapter focus tree, eventually kind of sort of can be. they get a 25 percent permanent reduction in coring costs or they could also join the texan economic union but they'd be independent for that oh but they're not going to do that so i figured you know what screw it the maxon chapter is going to be the colorado puppet for now just because i haven't released them as a puppet yet in any campaign at the time of this recording as well as if they make power armor then maybe we could take some of the power armor in. for new vegas there's no one new vegas new mexico there's not really anyone i really wanted to choose for these guys Lanius has had most of the cores on the land anyway, so I'm like, well, we might as well do it. So, anyways, we are at war with the Desperados, because I, I got really, really tired of them raiding me. So, here we go. And then we can also go to war with these guys. Now, I have taken a little piece of text around here, Spearman and Logan's Fall, just because we had war goals on them. I think, maybe? Oh, they're part of Texas. That's really why. I took them because they're part of Texas. And as someone recommended in the comments, don't release this part of Texas underneath these guys. <coughs> And just pretty much just keep the Cypher War Band, keep the Lost Lodge, and pretty much all of Texas, at least in my opinion. I'm probably not going to release Texas as an independent nation. I think it's time for the Sooner State to be stopping called Texas's hat, and just annex Texas. Now, some people might not like that, especially if they're from Texas, but just, we'll make it a little different than normal. There we go. And the, these guys over here can help out as well, and that'll be good. And we have another war goal, of course, for the Lost Lodge as well, in which we should probably start justifying on other people, too. Vital point targeting. Uh, the two pets. How strong are the Brotherhood members? They, they're they not that strong. They have a lot of divisions, but really not that strong. Oh, they're also fighting some other people, too. Hmm, that's quite a while to do. 110 days. Someone did say that the unity of Austin is looking a little thick. And yes, they are, but unfortunately for their thickness, it's going to have to be cut down. Let's see. Unfortunate, I know. But it must be done. Flexible designs, very good. Scrap, I think we're doing okay. Let's get some part standardization, very, very good. Unity of Austin will require quite a armed forces thing to do. Actually, just one solid line, that'll be good. And the Brotherhood, the Brotherhood, the Power Armor is doing pretty darn well, and they can't pierce us, which is awesome. So, you guys can tell, I can't tell, but this is probably going to be the last episode of the campaign, just because... We've got a good chunk of Colorado, not all of it, obviously. We've got a good chunk of New Mexico, which is pretty good. But, we'll see what happens. I don't know, just after this, there's not a whole lot much else to do. We're done with the focus tree as well, so. Let's see, I'll put you guys right here. Good. And then I'll put you guys right here, Reno. And I don't mind the waterways, if they're simple, simple, simple. So, oh, not right there. No, 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 no. Right there. There we go. Thank you. Very, very good. And a mecha. Oh, these guys are killing each other? Great. Wow. Well, yeah, we'll probably have to kill off Ezracito Mexicano. Let's see how long this video lasts, though. Usually, if I, I'll spend up to an hour usually for a video if need be, but it shouldn't take that long. Of course, the Unity of Austin are super mutants, so they probably don't have a lot of organization, so we're hoping that's a good case. But yeah, not yesterday's video, we ran out of manpower. That was kind of unnerving for me to run out of manpower, especially since we can't change our doctrines or. Our conscription level, I should say. So, there we go. There, there, there goes those guys. Very, very good. Uh, another comment from Mystery said that, Be careful that people can just navally invade your capital. And yes, they could. Lanius could have done that. And that would have been really, 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 really bad. Also, we have a goal here. Request building more military factories. Yeah, we need to build two more factories and we'll be okay. Let's go ahead and do... Subsidize invest stimulus. How much money do we have? Not a lot. Actually, I want to save my money then. Oh, I wanted to go to with Paris, Texas, huh? I did not realize that. Okay. Well, might as well. I'll take these guys along for the for the ride, because that's easiest to put down and put up. And then we'll go to war with 
you need to leave. Austin, actually for you guys, do you have any manpower you could give us? No? Yes. Okay then, thank you very much. We could definitely use those guys. Also, let's see. Good, props from the drug trade. If you'd like to read about this, go right ahead. Pass me a hit. In which I'm going to go ahead and core more of this territory. Because I've cored this. And that's still part of Oklahoma. But this is technically part of Texas. But we're going to annex it anyways. Because we can. That would be better to annex, but whatever. Thank you. 230. And we get 2.56 a day. That is really, really good, actually. Jet engines, don't mind if we do. Let's grab some better jet fighters. Thank you very much. And let's go ahead and go to war. Well, as we're waiting to go to war with Shale's army. No, it's not Shale's army. It's Unity of Austin. Yeah. Shale's army is no more. Have you a super mountain your tactics for a little slightly more organization as they're trying to really kill us off? But I don't think they're going to do that well. Go ahead and force the attack as well. And force defense. Because we can. Command power, 108. We get 1.12 a day. That's not bad. That's actually pretty good. Losses, 49 versus 330. 350. Not bad. Encirclements, delicious. Okay. Lanius? Okay. I was not expecting that yet. But hey, at least they're still going through their focus tree as best they can for now. Oh, they're doing... Oh, they're done with their focus tree then. Cool. Yep. You know what? That's okay with me, which means we just go, go to war with the Houston Rockets, and we don't have to justify them later on then. Cool. Jolly, jolly good. Alright, you guys come down here. Let's finish these guys off. And for now, I could put someone in our capital, but nah, I don't feel like it. You guys come down here or something. How does it feel, Kaiza? That you're... Eastern Legion, a cohort, as now my cohort. They don't care because they're fighting the NCR. And they're actually doing okay. Yeah. Someone recommends I play with the Courier 6 submod, I believe. I think I'm going to play that once. I can't remember. I need to go back and play them. New Vegas is fun. New Vegas actually is a lot of fun. Call everyone in. That's fine with me. Let you guys all attack. Oh, we're winning and losing in some places. That's fine. I'm, I'm glad we have some of our manpower back, though. That really does help. Oh, we can go to war with those guys too. Thank you very much. Cut you guys down in half. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. One, two. Ooh. Throw uh, them on there. Oh, well, it helps if we actually select the wings, air wings. Thank you very much. Very, very good. And I, I will get some more cast soon. And you guys are just kind of hanging out, moving along. That's fine. Well, all right. We didn't even see how many men they lost, but okay, whatever. Very good. And get ready for Shale's army. Uh, Shale's army, super mutants, super mutants, super mutants, super mutantos. Super mutantos. Well, try playing attackers. We don't have enough cast. Probably because we need to build more factories for them. Oh, wait. We can do this? Oh, here we go. The state's first elections. With most of the population of Oklahoma settled into our new government, we can look towards the first major step of any democracy, hosting an in election. Fun times for all. I wonder who's going to win. It's actually very weird, This the election for this uh, nation. It's very, very weird. Which I'll show you when the thing pops up again. So, And we have a war goal until... Oh, it's going to turn triumphant. Great robotics technology. Nice. And we, have to go, we can go to war until November 20th. Which we're looking pretty... Oh, crap. Oh, no, 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 no. No, please not that type of resistance. Please, for the love of God, please no. Oh, I hate... No, no. Oh, 100%. Oh, that's going to be so bad to fight through. Oh, we're going to lose so much equipment. Oh, no, 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 no. A thousand times no. Why do you pain me so? <sighs> Why? I don't like this. Uh, it's one thing if you ha run out of manpower, but you can still, like, make sure that resistance gets put down. But it's another thing to have maxed out resistance. Holy crudderinos. Why don't they have this core? These are some manpower, though. They must not be out of equipment. No. Uh, uh, they might be out of equipment then. Oh boy. That is not ideal. Uh, military signing bonuses are pretty good. Marlurks. Meh. 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 Well, I mean, we could literally wait here and just like watch them die, but we gotta move through this quickly enough. Who is this political power for less autonomy? No, that's nothing. It's really nothing. Because I'm building up a lot of their infrastructure. There you go. That's all you need. Alright, well. <sighs> Goodbye, equipment. Goodbye, division speed. Goodbye, everyone. So, for the front of you, like to read about this, go right ahead. I'm just going to go and just get some more wars, some political power, not war support, just because it's very nice to have that. Alright, so as we're taking more territory here, which we will take for ourselves, Los, eradicate it. Shows army, eradicate it. 
That is god awful. Oh my goodness. The AI really just does not know how to really respond to resistance. Look at the, our division equipment levels. Oh my gosh! 130. That's a bit extreme. I mean, at this point, that's that's extreme. That is that's a bit too much. Or at least if it's at 100, percent why doesn't anyone rebel? Okay, this is where the states for selections though. It has been um, okay a good many years since Harrison was able to call this land home. There were always enemies over that hill that you, that you had to fight. Always another battle to wage. Now that was over. Harrison and the ghouls of the last patrol, feeling that their eternal vigil is over, use this chance for something new to set up a true and proud election. Move away from the dictatorships of the wastelands and call back to something that people could be proud of. This first general election, after it was planned and organized, would go rather smoothly. Voters from the formerly conquered cities and tribes moved into ballot boxes, often being escorted out of their homes at gunpoint if they weren't patriotic enough to assist in the building of the new nation. Harrison expected this to go amazingly for him, for the people to accept his leadership with open arms. It seems instead that the opposite has happened. Rival candidates have took overtaken early results with overwhelming odds. By this point, Harrison doesn't have much he can do but either try to steal the election through ballot manipulation or through backing another candidate. This is my home, you can't take it from me. Lose to build your sport. And then... And this is, uh... Harrison's one, so... Or how about the candidate from the Lodge? Stability your sport. In which we get President Cortez from, like, Last Lodge? We get political power. The Federation's candidate seems enough knowledgeable enough. In which... P President Hajo becomes peop leader of the People Party? That's not bad. Casino heiress. Or I trust New Yen to build a moderate government. Why do we lose political power or stability or support for this? I don't understand that. But it doesn't make sense for any of these people to take power since, like, we conquered everyone else. So I like the daily compliance too. So I don't know why we lose that, but okay. Sure, why not? There we go. Military signing bonuses. Yeah, we can definitely use that now. Uh, that's why I'm not using my power armor over here yet. We can kill off a thousand, which isn't bad. It's not hard to kill off super mutants since they're really disorganized. Oh my goodness. Wow. It's about promoted, very good. Wow. Transports, jet fighters, it would be cool. Oh, since we're here. Oh, thank you. And a little bit ahead of time, but that's fine with me. Alright, so can I core anything else? Because we need this manpower immediately. No. Oh, there it is. Uh, it's, it's not really worth coring that piece, but it's the one we can core for now. And we lost all that manpower immediately. New Mariposa. Oh, new Mariposa. Oh, hello. Wow, that's thick. That's really thick. Yeah, oh, Cascadia's there, too. Oh, wait. I didn't fix this. Hold on. Hold hold, hold the phone. Hold the phone. Uh, NCR. Is there anything you can give NCR? Hold on. Are you all in the same fat? I'm sorry. I've got to do this. Uh, this is just too ugly. I should have done this in the last episode. There you go. That's better. They're just... Why? Please keep moving, guys. Please, 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 please. Now, we got point, extra point zero two compliance a day, but there's just so much god-awful resistance here that it pains us to see this. It pains me. New systems... Oh, I'll get that, too. Less resistance star get more daily compliance. Please, 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 please. Or type of administration. That's fine. Use an, I don't want to lose political power because I want to save political power so that we can core more stuff, so we can get more manpower, get more factories, even though we don't really need more factories. There goes the new timber line, and we'll probably need to start coring this, too, soon. Text Arcana. Good, better organization. And let's grab some of this for even more organization and some better modifiers. I thank you very much. Uh, sure, yeah, crowd control gear. Yeah, we definitely could probably use that now. Wow, missing 5,000 manpower. This is ridiculous. At least we dropped it to 78%. That's, that's better. Wow, we. Okay. Why not? You guys just come to Austin. We're going to spend some time just pushing down all this extra resistance. Oh my goodness, recycling is not bad. Let's go ahead and grab some of this. Resource efficiency gain. Thank you very much. Cancel Unleash. Army XP. Can only get 57 people every month. Resistance truck goes down. Add pre-war designs. We could do that. I want to save political power that profits from the drug trade. Song from the front. More political power. Caravan ambush. At least we can try. This happens every campaign, some way or another. At least we can try. Let's do that one. Petty criminal conscripts, huh? For us two lifetimes, there goes Santa Anna. I'm, I, I'm really considering doing that at this point. Specialized doctrines. Aerial warfare is good. Thank you. Come on. Oh, we took Austin. That's good. Get San, San Saba. Good lord. Alright, so they're gone. I'm tempted to just puppet them, but whatever, since I'm already getting really compliance anyways. 
Oh my goodness! Eradicate them, eradicate them. Eradications. Pacifications, eradicate them. Don't even worry about anything else, just eradicate these guys. Alright, so this isn't too bad. Obviously, their capital won't be too bad. Edgecito Mexicano. Yeah, they'll get, hopefully, a lot of resistance up here. We've got something about the, the Brotherhood as well, so. I'm not going to put you anywhere that requires us to eradicate resistance for now. So we'll put like four guys here. That's still Gator Miles. That's good. Good. This area should require not too much. Good. Good. Oh, and then we'll, we'll put eight up here then. It's fine. Since it, it's technically their puppet, so... And we have one army for all the waterways around here, and then even more, and then even more. Oh my, actually there's no, what? oh there's kind of a, a barrier right there. You guys, you probably can be put there. If we don't call in Lanius, then we can just put there. We don't need more manpower for this. Oof. Tax breaks for factories, dockyard output. Population? Yeah, we can get some more population, I suppose. 200 caps, that's not bad, actually. Advanced power systems, great. Grab some nuclear jet fighters, because we can. Probably missing a bunch of manpower for this. Casually 6,000. Casually 6,000. Tons of infantry armor as well. Hmm. Raider conscripts, huh? We can get 4% more recruitable population factor. Don't think that's really worth it, though, is it? Probably not. Damaged garrisons, yeah, that's good to have. Uh, nothing really here. This stuff is all, all okay. So you guys are you guys are getting higher and higher compliance for now, which is great. How about over here? This was one of the first tiles we took out. Twenty three thousand would not be bad. Twenty four thousand is a little better. That's good. That's good. And you guys are just kind of hanging out for now, which is totally fine. All right. So resistance is looking slightly better in some areas. So three. I think we can only afford three at a time here. Nothing down here, is there? No waterways? Nope. Resource production? Cool. Let's grab some brick housing. Because we don't have enough soldiers for this. One, two, three. And then again, I think they should be out of manpower. They're, they probably... Oh, God. They probably have a lot of resistance down there, too, do they? Oh, God. Cool. And... Uh, we could probably do this, that's fine. It doesn't really matter to me too much. One, two, three. Obviously, eradication costs the most. Which is fine with me for now, but... Oh, my goodness. And we're left with three. Well, that's not good. Of course, if we have the five up here, it won't matter too much, actually. Because these five should be able to push on pretty darn easily. In the meantime, have everyone train if they need to. That'd be fine. 405 man power. We can almost core this one. Almost core it. And then not need any more resources to put down resistance. Less than, less than 5,000 manpower needed. And a boatload of infantry armor. Alright, so we're 95% almost. It's still technically 94. Alright, I got 1,300 more manpower, but it went away immediately. The fall of Shitty Sands. NCR is wounded. Oh boy. Wow, Kaiser's Legion usually seems to win in my campaigns. I guess... I thought we left this on Historical. I guess Kaiser wins on Historical? I, can, I don't remember. I don't remember actually legit playing Historical without me messing up the Wasteland by conquering other people. So, don't really remember. Alright, so we probably need a lot less manpower now. Yeah, 2300 is still not bad, but not great. Alright, let's take a look at Resistance real quick. Pacification, Pacification. Oh, that's looking better. Let's go ahead and get some pacification here, just because we got to get some compliance. And that helps put down more resistance, too, actually. Uh, it's still too high. Anything below 50% is good. That'd be good. And actually, oh, uh, we got technology being done, too. And we'll grab some he troop, heavy trooper open area tactics. Good. And come over here. 20% is quite a bit. Eradication. Less than 50 is good. Eradication. Nice. Very nice. Uh, you want a gift? That's fine. I don't really care. So be it. Whatever. I guess for this one, we could probably just go in and do Spartak Outpost. That's fine. Doesn't matter to me too much. And actually, can we change this? Yes, we can. 
There we go. Now we get actually 3% more population. Thank goodness. I never like going down that path. That gives you minus 3% recruitable population. Or just population factor as recruitable population. Just because it's so bad. It's so detrimental. 3% can make or break your army. Let's go and start justifying these guys, though. Oh my goodness. They already have 86%. Oh my gosh. The AI really does not know what to do with this. So yeah. We're going to have a big old Texas. Oh, big old Oklahoma. Texas will be our puppet. Not even a puppet. Like... We're pulling the strings up top, still. Never enough political power, man. Never, ever enough. Actually, Puppet Ledger. I almost never look at this, but hey, it's good to know. What are they on? Conscription Law 12%. Children of Kaiser's Legacy. And Initiates. Oh, they're out of political power, too. Look at that. Wow. Pursuit? Oh, that sucks. We didn't win, but that's okay. Ooh, they have a lot of resistance down here. Well, they have a lot of divisions. They got 4,000 manpower. They'll probably core a lot of this, but not be able to core all of it. But the AI, for at least for Santa Ana, not Santa Ana, Imperial Mexicano, even Santa Ana, they're pretty good at putting down resistance. Other nations? Not so much. Not so much. They're completely out of manpower. Like, Oh, actually, we actually have a little bit of manpower. Not bad. Construction-wise, what are we doing? We're building a lot in other places. So Viet don't really care. Build some more civilian factories, because you can. Build some more air bases down here, because we're going to need them. And then build some radar stations, too, because we're going to need as much information to help beat the snot out of these guys as fast as possible. New citizen's gear package, thank you very much. And, ooh, advanced energy weapons, don't want to be do. Yeah, we'll do that. But it has to be at least 2283 next year. Or, oh, we need army XP. That's what we need. Ooh, let's go and do this. Occupy territories. I think at this point, they're all at least under 50%, so. Everyone, pacify. Thank you, thank you very much. Spread outposts are fine to do for now for that area. That's fine. Uh, not quite there yet. So yeah, uh, we put them down. We're going to need all this extra manpower, all these extra equipment pieces, because, well, we got to put down a lot of the resistance from the Brotherhood as well, because they big dum-dums. That's effectively why. Actually, you guys, you're not going to do that. That's crazy. You guys, on the other hand, you guys could probably actually do well. You need Boston, not looking too bad, 58% compliant. Great. Oh, we core this. Yeah, let's core this then. Why not? It's not quite 300 political power, and we get free core. I love it. More manpower? Don't mind if we do. Nuclear power jet attack planes? Because we can. Production? Some of the best fighters. Not bad. Reliability actually goes down by quite a bit. Do that. Less agility. Less weapons. Less... There we go. A lot more reliability. Goodbye. There we go. And gunships is what something that we really, really, really want a lot of. Over here, nothing there, nothing. Eh, recon, nope. Goodbye. Help settlements out, and we still get what 57 guys, 154 guys. Wow, a month. That's not bad. Air raid, air base raids, not bad. Let's grab some dive bombing, yes please, and come over here, and so we can do some power armor scavenger stuff. Uh, tax breaks, invest into military academies. Uh, that stuff is okay. How much money do we have? Only 580. Well, we could subsidize these people and tax them. Ooh. We lower their autonomy some more. Why not? Get everything we can. Natural disasters. Well, that's not good. Oh, why is it lagging so hard? Oh! The Legion's exploded. 690 caps? No, I'm not going to do that. we got nothing to spare then. It's only less ability for a while. Son Sons of Kaiser. Lucius prevails. Ah, so Lucius is going to be the one here that's going to win, probably. Because he's got his focus tree, and these guys probably don't have cores on the... Well, they do have some cores. Not all of them, though. Oh, and they're fighting Gentle, maybe? Maybe not? No, maybe not. Oh, Vulpus. Oh, that was... Oh, the they're still fighting the NCR. I thought the NCR capitulated. Oh, yeah. So, I guess... Is that... Is that really historical? If... So, the NCR lose, losing is was losing... And then Kaiser dies, thus splitting his legion up into different parts. Gosh. Sounds really bad. Glad that's not us, though. I'm not sure how we would split up. I guess technically we could split up Oklahoma more. We did have the tribal federations and... What was it? The chain choir who's working with us now, but still. Alright, when can we go to war? Please don't tell me they got a 85%, 87%, oh my gosh. Oh, I should not have given this to them after the war. Oh my goodness. Why? The fall flagstaff? Well, it's not hard to kill the Legion when they have, when they're split into three. Stockpile-wise, they have some infantry armor and some, they have a lot of infantry equipment. They're just out of manpower. 
Let's go and do this. Special Forces expansion. That'd be good. Alright. How much longer must we wait? Oh, four days. That's not bad. Got more. Hey, look at that. Almost 6,000 manpower. Finally. Oh, Lockkeeper's cool. There we go. I'm just going to call in all of our allies. That's fine with me. I don't care. I really don't. I, I can't imagine these guys would be too difficult to take out with no manpower, so... And once they're done, we'll go to war with these guys. These guys have been called in. Okay, so you guys gotta start attacking now. And Lafayette, Gator Maz, we might as well take them out as well. They'll probably Pecos Colony after this, just because that'd probably be good. Nice. Alright, take a look at here. Alright, pacification, eradication. Pacification, eradication. 36%, eradication. I'm not, I'm not messing around with this stuff, man. You just can't. Actually, all of you guys, except for you. Oh, come on. Come on, game. Not except for you. Give me this. Cut, cut, cut. 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 Go. Ahead. That's much better. There we go. You can force the attack. Doesn't matter to me. Ooh, you guys are coming down here. Oh, are you, are you guys not going? Go ahead, guys. Come on. Don't get encircled. Okay, seriously. What are you... Are you I want to see some action here. Uh, so they're uh, they're actually spanning out. That's not good, uh, guys. I would really recommend you start moving your butts now. Come on, get Dallas. There you go. Start moving out. You guys will finish these guys off pretty quickly. Even if they get all the way up here, that's pretty tough for them to do so. So, good. More states cord. More manpower. Maybe a few more factories. We're still mobilizing. Ah, oh, thank goodness we can cut these guys off too. Wow. Get a crack it, Huntsville. Turn the other fox. Don't mind if we do. Hey, there we go. Woo, we got him. Time to put up, put down a bunch of resistance again. Cool. Hey, free slaves, 480. Thank you very much. And we'll come right here. Now, let's take a look at this once again, just in case eradication is good. Pacification, pacification, pacification is okay. Eradication, pacification, eradication is good. Wow, look at that manpower now. Oh my goodness. Not very buena, but it is what it is. Oh, do we have a lot of... Oh, there is quite a bit of resistance in some of these areas, which is not ideal. But it's going down pretty quickly. Wow, it went down by 0.5. And 0.5 again. Nice. That's not bad. That's actually really, really good. Of course, again, we don't have a lot of equipment, but we've got to kill off Imperial Mexicano. So we only have a few more nations to kill off. So it's Pecos Colony, Imperial Mexicano, Houston Rockets. We might kill these guys off, too. Just because we can. Scavenger return triumphant. Thank you very much for bonus naval technology. We got economic resurgence. How delightful. Let's grab some of that because we can. Oh, wait. I should have done that. Oh, we lost our HP anyways. Whatever. Yeah, we could get advanced energy weapons, but whatever. That's fine. Oh, look at this. Yes, please. You can't give me more garrison support? Oh, man. Um, we are building in Lannis's area here, so that only makes sense why he's giving us stuff. Get more scrap. Or, no, it's power. Whoopsie. That's power. Marfa? Oh, we can go to war with these guys, too. Oh, well, then, maybe so. Oh, we got more manpower back already. Great. Ooh, we're missing some dogs, but that's okay. Nuclear attack, attack planes is fine. Let's go up on this, too. That's good. Three-ish? Oh, let's, let's see. What are, we, are we under 50% in some places here? Eradication, eradication. Oh, here we are. There you go. That's better. Pacification. Good. Get more compliance. I love that you can do stuff with this with this stuff. I love it so much more than like a Vic Victoria 2. No. But uh, a base game for any almost any other mod for getting more compliance. That's why I love Old World Blue so much, especially after a lot of resistance came out. Because it makes it so it makes it easier. It makes it just so much easier actually to play this mod when you can just core other enemies' nations to get their more manpower, factories, and stuff like that. You really just snowball into someone really, really mighty. So it, it really doesn't end up being that difficult. Usually, I mean, some campaigns are quite difficult. Some other ones, not too much. So I really like that. Like in Kaiserreich. God, I wish this mechanic was in Kaiserreich. At least it doesn't make nearly as much sense. But, man, if we had something like this in Kaiserreich, that'd be great. Even like half the effects of like waste on pacification get even more compliance would be so awesome. But it's not a... Well, I guess Kazrak technically isn't a wasteland. 
but still. All right, Pecos has fallen. They've lost about a thousand. They've lost a couple divisions. Nice, nice, nice. Where do we need next? Terlingua, huh? Very cool. Shouldn't take too much from there. Hey, more factories. Don't oh, wonder we do. Oh, we got even more transports too. Oh, we're gonna need some more uh, advanced components though. Go and put them on there. We'll probably need that. That's probably the most, one of the most important things that we need. Power armor scavengers. Oh, new systems care package. Yes, please. Thank you very much. Now, Lanius, did you guys say you were at war with them, or? Oh, we, they are, so that's actually really nice. After this, I'm just to find Gator Maws. I mean, we might as well take the rest of Louisiana, right? That's part of Louisiana already. We've already taken Desperados, because they were pieces of garbage to us. So, that's fine. That's fine, fine, fine. And you know what? I'm going to do this off screen and just, I'll see you guys in just a little bit when we are ready to go to war with, what's it, Gator Maws? I'll be right back. All right, everyone, here we are, and let us continue with our little conquest. We've got our war goal against them Gator Maws. We're justifying, I believe, on the patrolmen, just because we can, but let's go and go to war with these guys first and lose the first few battles. Or how about we don't lose a few battles and we lose our some manpower too, instead. Well, we'll see what happens. Regardless, let's go and go to war with the Houston Rockets as well. That should be pretty darn good. Call you in, call you in. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And cut involved in your war as well. Thank you. Nice. We should do relatively okay. I'll put a few more gunships on here, and we're going to lose our power armor division because I was a little crazy with it. So be it. Whatever. The power armor isn't very good in this campaign just because we don't have any... We don't really have that much good power armor anyway, so it's all right. Whatever. They had their duty. They know what to do. And we're making some more divisions. Actually, off screen, I looked at my templates... And there were only 16 combat with. I didn't put on the two ghouls, but now we have 20 combat with, obviously. But that's kind of funny. We went this almost entire this entire campaign, and only now I realize we had 16 combat with infantry. Not bad. We did pretty darn well, I'd say. Got plenty of uh, manpower now. We've been quarrying more territories. Let's see. It's been a, it's been a mess of what we cored. So not exactly sure what we cored, but it was part of Texas, North Texas, of course. So. All right, you guys did a great job. Uh, I mean, I guess you guys could help out if you really wanted to take these guys out as well. Because the power armor, it's not great, but I like it. I love power armor. Probably too much. There you go. And now we're going to deal with this mess we call... Emperor Mexicano, who's dying to Ejusito Liberator del Sur. So we must search just on Zapata. Who's fighting a lot of different people. Holy cow, look at that. He's fighting so many different people at once. Nueva Atzlan, and then these guys over here, and then maybe even... Is it Gento? No. Oh, who else are you fighting? Imperial Mexicano. Oh, well, whatever. It doesn't really matter. All that matters is that as long as they are under us. Yeah, for each side, great. 240 more manpower. Sure, why not? Yeah, we could use better divisions. <laughs> better, Just better armor. It's not even divisions. The te divisions are fine. It's the armor that sucks. It's alright, though. Y'all should do okay. That's why it's, it's dangerous using force attack sometimes. It's really, really dangerous. Dina was annexed by the ciphers. Cool. Boom, 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 boom. Very nice. Shouldn't take too much longer to kill these guys off and then get go to war with these guys, maybe. Oh, the cannery? Cool. Awesome. Might as well just go, go, go ahead. Doesn't matter to me. Y'all, let's get to the cannery if we can. That'd be great. New Mayor Post declared one of the Shoshone Nation. Good luck, guys. Good luck to all those involved. Ooh, we overran a couple divisions there. 1,065, not bad. We lost 15 guys so far. Well, minus the, the entire army we lost, or the entire divisions we lost against with using a power armor. But we don't, that's fake news. We don't talk about that. They died heroic deaths. That's what we can say. And we cut off a few more divisions, and Lafayette is ours. Cool. So I'm going to retire you guys over here. And actually, I'm going to split you guys up into half, probably. Half of you guys go there. Do your best, and then the other half come over here because we don't have enough armies for this, so it doesn't matter. Get to the line if you can. All right, let's divide you. Uh, well, Imperial Mexicano should die soon enough. I'm going to deploy the lines as soon as we need to, so you guys come over there. All of you guys go there except for one dude. You just kind of hang out, have a good time. And as long as I can't get any more organization, they'll be fine. And the cannery's ours. Boom! Thank you, bye, you motors. Very, very good. We're gonna go and do this just because we can. Travel huts for nice. Very good. Thank you. And uh, resource extraction. Why not? Yeah, Zabata is doing a very, very good job. Despite being at war with uh, two 
Technically three fronts. Gosh dang. We got plenty of infantry equipment. We got plenty of enough equipment at all. Also, Volpus's Legion did win. But as you can tell, the NCR is a real big winner here. So, it is what it is. Uh, new system skill package because we can. Cyclic fire, very, very good. Grab some missile launcherinos. And Volpus's Legion was just annexed. Nice. Oh, I, cops, I gotta stop spending army XP. Ah, oh, whatever. But at least Le Lesian is ours. You guys should capitulate very soon, though. They've even broken into Texas. Now that's unacceptable. 59,000 versus 7,000. Holy smokes. They lost 10,000, too. Almost 11,000. Wait, how are they not dead yet? Oh, they're close. Oh, they're super close. Actually, how many divisions do they have? I mean, against us, we'll do okay because we can probably pierce them, but... And we have gunships, too, so I'm not too worried about it. Economic resurgence is nice. We have only 3,800 caps, that's all. Invest into the military academy. You can do that. Cannery's been disabled. Subsidize, subsidize. Don't pop it. Or don't uh, tax, I mean. Go and do that. Help followers out. Cool. Yeah, they're just flooding through here. Once they, they take Carlota, that should be the end of them. Because actually, they have that as a core, huh? I didn't realize that. And I want a core Los, because it's so good. Almost 60,000 people there. So good, but then we don't have enough compliance around here either, so. We'll get there soon. And there we go. All right, it's time for us to do what we do best and take out enemy nations. All right, so good luck with that, guys. You're going to need some luck. And here, oh, it's going to suck. Uh, I don't really want to extend my line too much, so you guys do this as well. If we can push over the river quickly enough, we'll do okay. I'm not too worried about that. Over here, I can't be bothered to do this stuff over there, so... There you go. Oh my goodness. Uh, waterways. Why, 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 why? And then I'm going to grab one. I know I'm leaving a hole open, but I don't really care. As long as you can... Oh, they're even looking a little weak now. That's good. Ciphers. Get these guys done if you can. Equipment. You can do that because we can. Because why not? And I did put some guys over here to help put down resistance, so that's... I thought that was kind of smart, so I have to declare one on the reservation. Whatever. There we go. Let's core this so we can get down to Los next. 22,000 manpower. I love Old World Blues. God, it's so good. Good, 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 good. Go ahead and trade if you need it. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, you guys. Come to there. That'd be great. And you guys, just do whatever you can. No, you don't want to go over there? Why can't you do that? What the heck? Whatever. Yeah, they're looking a little weak in some areas, which is nice. We got enough planes, hopefully. Ooh, gunships. Oh, yes. I could transport or, you know, pair drop on enemies, but I'm not, I'm not feeling like that right now. I'll be honest, I don't feel like it. That just takes a lot of preparation, and, and since it's like the final episode of this campaign, I'm like, eh, we could, but nah. Just support, good. Deploying. Deploy some more. You guys come over here. 150 for all these guys in terms of casts, at minimum. Very nice. Missile launchers will come in handy. Tesla cannons, yes, please. Aerial refueling is not bad either. Now we can go to war with them. Great. Let's grab some. None of that. None of that. None of this. But some of this down here. That's weird. We haven't even finished our special forces doctrine yet. But that's okay. Go and stop doing this. Thank you very much. Three. Oh, they got some resistance, too. Oh, but they're putting down resistance. 0.9 goes down to 0.4. Not bad. Let's make sure we do this, too. Better rocket launchers. Thank you. One Arenos. Well, let's see what we can cook up. Can you smell what Oklahoma is cooking? Sometimes defeat, but sometimes winning. We lost 200 versus 900. Not bad. Power armor. This is a bad idea, but you're going to force the attack again. Uh, okay. All of you, like, all but you stop. Please. Please get up there. Please make sure they don't get too large. Please. And thank you. Thank you very much. That should be a fine enough. What the heck? Why do you bend in the line sometimes, guys? Hey, an encirclement. Not bad. Please. They're just robots. They can't think. They can't feel. So if you kill them, they they won't complain. Now this is better. Cool. Alright, we've lost about 300 versus 4,300. Not bad. Love it. Got uh, Actually, how much air damage are we doing? 0.4, that's not what I wanted. 42, now that's pretty, that's starting to get pretty juicy there. 41-ish, that's pretty juicy, I love it. Juicy? 
Well, I don't like her dry, I guess I'll say. Let's grab some Foxhole Doctrines. Make her special forces even better, because sometimes they can appear to be very not super strong. Not weak! We don't believe in weakness here. Just not too super strong. No one has upgraded, so be it whatever. Nah, scale them off. Get rid of them. The swamps of Texas. And then the deserts of Texas up here, too. Oh, oh, good lord. This is disgusting. Whee! If we get Tori on, that might be enough for us to actually capitulate them. I'm sure they got plenty of manpower now, though, still. Yeah, I got 15,000, 103 factories, 126 divisions. Hopefully that number is going to be dropping very soon. Layered air zones, don't mind if we do. Let's grab some of this, because we can, because why not? Power armored scavengers attacked. Oh, well, that's not bueno. No, it ain't. All right, guys, please get rid of them. Thank you. Goodbye. All right, so you guys, let's come back up here. Because I want to make sure these guys cannot kill us off up here. That would not be very bueno for us. Especially since they have a port and they're going crazy. Actually, if anything, if you really want to, you guys come to this side. There you go. There do we go. Here we go. Good, good, good. Grab some of this air superiority. Very nice. Great, no, great news. And they're not even close to capitulating at all. They've lost 20,000 people, but that means nothing to them. We've killed off 12,500 of them. Caravan ambush. At least we can try. Right now, what can we do with... No, wrong thing. What can we do with these guys? Yes, please. That's not bad, in my opinion. Y'all doing okay? Y'all doing okay? Y'all keep going? And you guys are still beating up the enemies very nicely. Very good. Even more factorinos. Well, more doggies. I love the doggies. Hope you love the doggies as well. Good, good, good. Overran a few more divisions. They have only 81 left. We've done 70% of all war score. Nueva Atsan can have a little bit, but all I, all I really wanted was um, Texas. That's all I really cared about, honestly. So, we'll, we'll release some Mexican puppets, because I think that's, that'd be appropriate. There you go. They go bye-bye. If you just hit them hard enough, they go bye-bye. They fall on the ground unconscious, and by unconscious, I mean they never wake up again. But then again, most of these guys are robots, so they never even began to think anyways. So, eh, let's see. Monterey. Oh, Monterey is always just like a bugged thing or something. And maybe it's not a bug right now, but I don't know. It's It always wants attention. I'll put it like that. It always wants attention, even when I don't want to give it attention. I was going to say, it's like... Hmm, is it like a child? Sometimes it wants attention, sometimes it doesn't. I don't know. I'm not a dad, don't ask me. I don't know. I don't know anything. I know nothing. Beautiful. Oh, oh, good. Aguas Calientes. Cool. They have less than 80 divisions, of course, 74. They've only lost 30,000 manpower. We've only lost less than 1,000. We could be doing better, I know. I know we could be, but it is the hand that we have right now. There we go. We're getting closer. Oh, we're actually attacking the capital. Nice. Oh, a brand division. Please get rid of that area group, guys, please. Hey, take the capital again. They have less than 70 divisions now. Beautiful! Something can level up to level 8. Alright, I guess we'll make this level 8. Awesome. More money. And are they dead? Not yet. Just a little bit of lag. They should be getting close to dying off. They have only less than 60 divisions now, which is bueno. Which is what they might say in Zapata's lands, but you never know. Go and do that, guys. Come on, keep going. Okay, guys, I know moving is hard, but we have enough energy cells, and you got plenty of range. Okay, I'm going to manually force you to do something then. Come on. Terlingua. There we go. And non-theological bombing. Thank you very much. Oh, wow, we really spread out through here, didn't we? Oh, look at this. This is kind of ugly. Get rid of them. So I'm going to have you guys focus down here. Come up through here. You guys are already down here, but I'm going to actually move you guys up here. Take these guys out. Ah, that's what the next capital is. And you guys, you're kind of already basically down here, so whatever. Just go ahead. And you guys, please do something. Please clap. There you go. Alright, they got to be giving up soon.
Not bad, not great. And loss. We shall appreciate your integration into the state of Oklahoma. Good, 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 good. Please do not need a guard against Nueva Atzalan. They are not your enemy for now. Thank you very much. Good. Get them, get them over. And they're over. They keep going. They keep going. Should be done soon. Oh come on, Zapata. Zapata. 100% way there. Oh, they're done. Great. So let's get some of territory to Nueva Atzalan, and we'll take the rest because I don't think anyone else really deserves too much here. But we'll see what happens. All right. I'm going to assume about 20% order score for these guys, so we'll give them a good chunk of all this. You can have gotten wood cups as well. That's not too bad. Cool. And I'll take the rest. Alright, and let's have a good... Ooh! Peace deal. Let's see. Occupied territories. Ooh, and the city to Mexicano. Rada, rada, rada. Rada, rada, rada. Or at least these guys. But well, we're not going to give them their part of Texas. You on Texas? I will make sure that you are just a footnote in history. No, 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 no. This is ours. This is definitely ours. Yeah, you don't get that stuff. All right, anyone else? Oklahoma? That's weird to see Oklahoma down here. Let's see. Anywhere up top? Alamo chapter? No. Assassin? No. No. That's fine. Del Sur? Santa Ana? Well, we don't want Santa Ana doing or messing us up too hard. We'll see, maybe. No, we'll release this stuff. Let's see. Last Lodge, Patrolman. Well, maybe we'll have to release them then. Paco's Colony, Lubbock, Los. Yeah, there you go. And no, you, we, we own Texas. You ain't gonna get it. No, no, no. Alright, so give me, give me this back. You want too much, son. You want too much. There we go. That's better. Um. Wait, did I release you as a puppet? I must have. Oh, if that's the case, you can have this back, too. Soon a little cartel gets can't release them, I suppose. Can we? Can we release them? No, don't return the territory. Oh, there they are. Good God, that's ugly. Actually... They may be a cartel, but they're a cartel under us. Ah, there we go. Much better. But I think that's going to end our campaign here, my friends. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. I really hope you appreciate the new Oklahoman, Texan, Louisiana state. And I'll see you all in a different campaign tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.